Hello, my name is Rachel and I love shopping. And yesterday my roommate Carol and I decided we would do some last minute Halloween shopping. Um, and most of the stores, the Halloween stuff was mostly wiped out. You know, it's all been condensed to a small little area somewhere in the store and all the Christmas stuff has already been <laughs> ushered in. But we did still find a few nice things. Um, Carol only got one Halloween thing, which she uh, did let me use to or let me keep here to show you guys. So I'm going to start with that. And we found this at Ross and she found this amazing candle. It doesn't smell like anything, but it's a candle you wouldn't want to burn anyway because it's just beautiful. It's got like the rose gold bees and the honeycomb print and it's a skull and it was marked down to only two dollars. So she got quite the deal on this amazing candle. <laughs> And then also at Ross, I got, Carol did buy more stuff, but she just bought some shoes and a coat. And <laughs> but I went Halloween. <laughs> I did Halloween stuff. <laughs> so uh, also at Ross, I did get this jack-o'-lantern pancake set. And it has this adorable little jack-o'-lantern pancake pan to make these little, you know, jack-o'-lantern pancakes. It says it has pancake mix with it but I don't think it has the mix with it anymore because it feels super light and you open it up here just to well no maybe <laughs> it actually does have a tiny little thing of pancake mix in it what is that like two pancakes <laughs> so that's funny <laughs> it says serving size one bag so one pancake <laughs> it's enough um, pancake mix for one pancake <laughs> that's funny but I have a box of pancake mix so I don't really need that um, but this was also marked down to only two dollars <laughs> and I just thought that pan was adorable <laughs> and then I bought hand soaps Halloween hand soaps this one is so cute it's uh, you know just a, a thing of it's a foaming hand soap and but it came in this little container, this little holder. And we had actually, we also went to um, Bath and Body Works and they had lots of stuff like this. But there's like, they had a, a soap holder for their soaps that I really wanted. But even with the 50% off, it was still something like $13. But this whole set with the soap and this cute little ceramic bat was only $4. It was marked down to $3.99. So how cute is he? He needs to be cleaned up. It looks like he had a sticker on him and he has like all sorts of sticker residue on the front of him there. <laughs> but I, I do need to clean him up. But he's just so cute. And, you know, hand soap. I've got, I got so much hand soap. <laughs> I feel like this should be called my hand soap haul. <laughs> You'll see when I get to the Bath and Body Works bag. But then the other thing that I did get at Ross, also hand soap, was just another thing of foaming hand soap by Nicole Miller Halloween Horror. And it's got a pretty little label on it. Oh, I didn't realize how pretty the label was. I think it's the lights are making the uh, holographic really pop. Because when I looked at it in the store, it just seemed kind of silvery. But that is awesome. <laughs> but yeah, so I just got th uh, those three things at Ross. Next, I will do Bath and Body Works. Because <laughs> more hand soap. I got three hand soaps. Their hand soaps uh, were marked down. Or the Halloween hand soaps, not all their hand soaps. Their Halloween hand soaps were marked down to, I think, $3.25 a piece. So like... I guess about half price because they're normally $7.50, $3.75, so $3.75 a piece. So yeah, they were half price. So I did get a Ghoul Friend and this this one is not foaming. This is just the regular gel hand soap. I got Ghoul Friends. All three of them are just the regular gel hand soap. The last time I got Bath and Body Works hand soaps, I did get all foaming ones. But this time I just got, this one came undone a little. It smells nice though. This is the Vampire Blood one. Again, just the gel hand soap. And then the final one I got was this marshmallow pumpkin latte. And this was with the Halloween hand soaps. But when I went up to the register, she was, uh, it rang up at full price. And I was like, um, they're all over there with the 50% the off one. So she still gave it to me for the, the discounted price. So I got this one also for the 375. I was like, you might want to go move those if those aren't on sale because they had like a whole bunch of these with the Halloween soaps with the big sign that said, you know, three, whatever it was. <laughs> and then the last thing I did get at Bath and Body Works is uh, one of the wallflower things. Uh, Carol actually has one of the cartridges and it's just been sitting on my kitchen table forever. <laughs> 
So I was like, I'll get one of these so we can actually use it. And uh, this one's actually a nightlight. And it's so cute because he's like this little, if I can get the, I don't know if you can, uh, he's just going to have the ring in him because he's so shiny. But yeah, he's just a, um, you know, bat, a iridescent bat nightlight. Uh, he glows. <laughs> and um, yeah, so I'll, I'll get to finally use that. But this, this was kind of expensive. Even though it was 50% off, it still came to like $11. It was like $22 full price. I don't see it on here, but on my receipts. Yeah, the full price on this was $22.50. So it was still $11.25. So it was still a little bit pricey, but I thought it was super cute. And yeah, <laughs> Halloween. Next, we, we did stop at a Michaels and Michaels was having 60% off of their Halloween stuff got a couple of things. I got a little sticker booklet which just have like the Day of the Dead skulls and just a bunch of pages. <laughs> these are cute but yeah so I just got a sticker book and then I did get these washi tapes because I just thought they were really pretty. And then the last thing I got at Michael's, <laughs> it was only $10. And at first I wasn't going to because I thought it was just a you know, plain witch hat. And I don't like the really like spiky tall witch hats. But you can bend the top. It has a wire in there. So you can actually bend it over and give it that cute little quirky witch hat look, which I, I do like. So I went ahead and got it even though, yeah. I don't really necessarily need a witch hat, but I thought it was super cute. And I actually have a dress that matches this. It's the it's red with the skull fabric on it. So I thought that would be a cute little outfit. And then the very last thing, I only got one more thing. Like I said, this was this was a pretty small haul. Uh, most of the stuff, like, as I said, was picked over and sold out. But this wasn't. This is Halloween, but at the same time, not Halloween, because this was actually a Christmas gift set. And I just became obsessed with it. <laughs> it's by Betsy Johnson. And it's a purse and wallet set. And how cute is that? And this, as you can see, was $30. And that's a little bit more than I normally pay for purses because I'm cheap. <laughs> but I, I was just obsessed with the little skull embossing on there. And it has a cute little wallet. A little wallet for your cards and on the back has for your ID and then just that per and it's a crossbody bag and and that's what I primarily use for my everyday bag so I am planning on switching out my everyday bag to this currently I'm still using that five dollar bat one that I got at Shein like either last year or the year before I can't even remember but I've used it non-stop since whenever I bought it and that five dollar Shein bag has somehow managed to last that long <laughs> It's beginning to get a little threadbare though, so it's time time for something new, time to move on, and I was just obsessed. But the, again, this was, it's a Christmas gift set. <laughs> they had a couple other sets, like the same style, but different prints. One was like a lilac with a floral wallet, and one was, I think, beige. <laughs> but this was the only one with skulls on. And I was like, well, that's still Halloween. It's got skulls all over it. That's perfect. My only regret as a... As, uh, Pixie over on the channel sequence always says, why is it always gold hardware? Why always gold hardware? But I don't mind because it's Betsy Johnson and I do love Betsy Johnson. So that is everything that I got and what is obviously because it's only a few days left to Halloween, my final Halloween haul. I didn't do a lot of Halloween hauls this year because, you know, I'm on a low buy, not a no buy, a low buy. <laughs> and I, so I'd only done, I think I've only done one or two other ones. I can't even remember, but I haven't done many at all this year for the going out into the world and Halloween shopping. Maybe two other ones, I can't remember. But anyway, <laughs> this is definitely my final one though. But let me know what you thought about all of these purchases down in the comments below. And thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy the video, of course you can give it a thumbs down and please tell us all about it in the comments below. And please subscribe to the channel. And I hope everyone is just staying happy, healthy, and safe in this incredibly crazy world we're living in. And I will talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.